Hey guys, what's up? This is Apple Pro. In today's video, I'll be showing you how to jailbreak your iPod 4, iPod uh, 3G, iPod, I mean iPhone 4, iPod, uh, iPhone 3GS, and um, your iPad 1. So there's no jailbreak out for iPad uh, 2 or iPhone 4S. So what this jailbreak video is on is on 4 iOS 5.0.1 and I'm going to show you well I'm going to take my time to show you what firmware I'm on and uh, here's my iPod touch I just updated it and um, I'm slide to unlock go into settings right here which is right you go to general I'm going to go to about I'm going to show you my firmware, which will be right here. I don't know if you can see it or not, but you should be able to. As you can see, I am on 5.0.1. So first of all, um, it's gonna, you want to uh, open up iTunes. In this case, it will be right here. As you can see, my iPod Touch has been detected by iTunes. Now what you want to do is just you know, close that out. Well, you don't have to close it, but in this case, I'm just going to minimize it. All right. Okay, I'm just going to show you this recording it. Alright, so you want to turn off your device. So I'm just going to head out of settings here. Turn off your device. So make sure you use powered off. Alright. Powered. Slide to power off. And uh, just wait here. Okay, it is taking a little bit of time, but that's fine. Again, it is iOS 5.0.1, so there's a lot of new features, and it takes up a, a little bit of space. Anyways, it doesn't matter. Alright, so it has been turned off. Now, I'm just going to put that away for now. Now, what you want to do is download two things. I'm going to put the links in the description. So, the first thing you're going to download is, um, basically, Red Snow. Um, sorry about that. So, it's Red Snow, what you're going to download, and, uh, it, I think it's by, uh, 9.0. 10 beta 3 I'm not sure but I think that's it yeah it's right here so it's 0 0.9.10 beta 3 and I'll be putting that in the description so you can download that and the sec second thing you're going to download is I iOS 5.0.1 IPSW and um, for any uh, of your device except for iPod 4 I mean iPhone 4s or iPad 2 because there's no jailbreak for that yet Alright, so once you have those two things downloaded, open up Red Snow. I'll be putting the links in the description. Alright. Open up Red Snow. Hit. Just um, make sure you right click. I'm sorry, I just have a lot of programs on right now to make this video, so it's a little slow, but that's fine. I'm just going to wait here. Alright, you want to run as administrator. And uh, basically cancel your whatever doesn't really matter. In this case, I'm just gonna cancel um, the folder that I had Red Snow in. I'm just so that because you don't need that anymore. You just need Red Snow for this, basically. All right, again, I'm just gonna cancel the folder. I think I already have. It's just that it's lagging a bit. All right, so once you have Red Snow open, that's a good thing, I guess. No, it's it is a good thing. All right, now you want to go to extras. Go to select IPSW, and it's gonna ask you to basically find your IPSW. In this case, it's 5.0.1 because you're jailbreaking that untethered. So you want to hit open, and it should say the following build was identified: iPod 4, um, um, and 5.0.19a. Four zero five. It will be used for the rest of the rest of the session. Okay, it should say that. And after you, um, and if you have any other problems with this part, please leave your comments below. I'll be gladly be able to help you. Go back. Now you want to hit jailbreak. It's gonna ask you. It's not in, the, in this case. You don't have to put your device into DFU mode in this part. It's after. It's actually after this part. But anyway, it's gonna say patching kernel. And uh, you're just gonna wait. I'm not going to skip anything because I, would, I just want to show you how long each part takes. Anyways, just keep going here. Again, it's a little slow because my computer has a lot of programs open, but that's fine.
and now it's going to say preparing RAM disk and now what you want to do it's going to say select um, please select your options for iPod um, 4, 5.0.1 whatever whatever model number and yeah blah blah now it's up to you if you want to enable battery percentage uh, really it doesn't matter but in this case I'm just gonna do that you're gonna hit next now it's gonna say please make sure your device is both off and plugged into the computer in this case I do have it plugged into the computer as you can see the wire it is plugged in and uh, it is off I turned it off in the beginning of the video and you make sure it's also turned off and um, Again, now this is the part where you have to put your device in DFU mode. After you turn it off, what you want to do is hold the power button for three seconds, and then hold the um, home and the power button for another ten seconds, and then let go of the sleep button. Keep holding the home home button for another fifteen seconds until your iTunes rec recognizes you into recovery mode. But that won't really matter. I'm just gonna follow the on on screen instructions over here on this computer, just to you know do it step by step so I'm gonna hit next hold the sleep button for three two one hold the home eight seven six five four three two one let go of the sleep button keep holding the home button until your device is in DFU mode and again it's gonna uh, please wait your bill is being processed since it's already recognized it, it doesn't matter and now it's going to say exploding lime rain deploying first stage and that's it basically you're just going to hold now you're going to let go of the home screen button and that's it i'm just going to show the rest of the process right here on my device as you can see it says geo um downloading jailbreak data and also it's saying uploading ram disk and uploading ram disk is complete and now uploading kernel now as you can see you get a lot of codes whatever blah 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 and now the rest of the stuff um, will take place on your iDevice in this case I'm just gonna show you um, everything I'm not gonna skip any of the video doesn't matter really I'm just gonna just hold my iPod here. So you can head out of snow, uh, red snow now. It doesn't. You don't need it. So you can just hit, uh, you can just cancel it. I'm just gonna bring this in the middle of the screen, middle of the screen now. Yeah, I'm just using my webcam here to record everything. It's just that my camera is a little busted. So yeah, yeah. As you can see, you'll get a lot of these random codes. But don't worry, it's nothing. It's not like oh, I'm gonna die on my device. I'm gonna get killed. No, my parents gonna kill me. It's for it's so expensive. What's what's happening right now? Oh my god! No, 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 no! Don't worry. It's nothing. This is the part of the jailbreak session. It's nothing. All right. Because I have jailbreak jailbroke my iPod Touch a lot of times. All right. After that, I should there should be a pineapple logo as you can see, and uh, that's the logo for Red Snow. So again, yeah, and now it should say moving applications. Now it will be stuck on this part for a long time and uh, I'm not going to skip it because I want to show you how long each step takes alright so uh, my hand is a little tired of just holding this up for you but or again it's just a video don't worry about that okay it should take about a few minutes but that's fine really it doesn't matter again I'm not skipping anything that's a good part it's a good part of me and uh, I think you will understand every step that I did and it should jailbreak your device smoothly and um, yeah but to be honest you really don't need the IPSW all you have to do I did that because that's the way my iPod gets recognized uh, if I don't do that I, um, uh, check IPSW because then my iPod touch does not get recognized and I and it doesn't jailbreak it so that's why I had to do that and uh, that's probably the simplest way you can jailbreak your iDevice without any getting any errors from red snow and yeah that's the way I did it so basically yeah and yeah you should be happy because your iPod touch is getting jailbreaking untethered on 5.0.1 iOS and I told you I would be making this video. I mean, I told you on, on my other videos that my iPod Touch is on 4.3.3 because, you know, I couldn't jailbreak and stuff. So, and yeah, because my iPod Touch wasn't getting recognized, but then I found a way, and yeah, it finally did get recognized.
and again it has moved on from moving applications and it should be waiting for a reboot device and again it has just rebooted and yeah that's the whole jailbreaking uh, process and you're done completing it after your device has been booted up um, uh, I'll be right back hey guys so I'm back and uh, my iPod touch has been booted up and it's gonna be ready to rock and roll in front of you guys and uh, as you can see slide to unlock right there I'm back normal everything is normal and I have all my other stuff that I had in the beginning of the video nothing really happened wrong nothing went wrong and there you go I have Cydia and you can just um okay I'll be right back in a minute oh sorry guys I just had something to do alright so as you can see I have Cydia I'm just gonna tap that and again it's working smoothly everything is going fine I, uh, what I do is run as developer I don't go as a user or a hacker I go as a developer that's just my way of doing this and um, you should have city in no time uh, well working in no time well yeah you're supposed to tap done over here I forgot that so you tap done and yeah there you go yeah city thank you for watching this video I hope you like it please subscribe comment and like fave thank you for watching bye bye